What's up, y'all? This is Aunt Glizzy, and this is Son TV, and this the inside man. It say Earl was on yelling, he saved you from shot. Earl so much of a fan, I don't need no Earl now, but Earl was in the live. When Shot said he was pulling up, Earl was in the live, like, I'm about to pull up right there. I ain't calling no niggas. I don't be calling these niggas, bro. I done robbed Earl. I done robbed Earl whole neighborhood. Shot at Earl whole neighborhood. They know that. He know that. I ain't know no gangster shit. I'm out the streets now, but he know what's up. I ain't no slouch ass nigga. The fuck? Earl and his neighborhood was beefing with the guys. Why? Because of me. I stuck all they ass up. It was eight of they ass. I stuck all they ass up. Dice game. Lift that motherfucker up. Lost my money. Everybody. Put their ass all to the everybody down. Empty everybody pockets. Get the fuck on. I let Bijou go because I got a heart. Bijou is my little man. Go ahead, Bijou. Get on. Your friends, they ass got to get that shit up. Give me their pockets. Then we went to war behind their neighborhood with that shit on me. I put that shit on. Ask them. They know the fuck is up with me. The whole 17th and Compton know what the fuck is up with me. I walked through that motherfucker. I had put that shit on. I put that shit on. They know Mr. Uncle Buckets. Fuck you talking about. Ask Earl this. Do he remember riding his bike past the guys and, and Uncle Buckets dropped buckets on his ass? Earl, they got buckets dropped on his ass riding the bike past the guys. Fuck you talking about. These niggas don't want no trouble with me. I just be being humble on this YouTube shit. I'm everything I say I am. These niggas ain't no shit out here. These niggas ain't no fucking thugs. You think these niggas go out? Talking about whole neighborhoods, grown ass men, them niggas grown now and stuck they ass up, man. What they gonna do? Nothing. <laughs> on my mother, I walk through that joint on feet. I walk through that motherfucker on feet, no mask. I ain't gonna say who I was with, cause the, I don't wanna incriminate them, I incriminate myself. I walk through that motherfucker on feet with no mask. Niggas watch me from a window. Let me tell you how I know they watch me from a window. Because when me and Earl got cool, he said, bro, remember that day you walked through here, bro? We was in the trap. We was looking at you out the window. Yeah, I was looking out the window. Why y'all ain't shoot out the window? Come outside, bang it out, do something. Because them niggas be scared and shit. Like, I don't be playing with niggas. Like, when it's go time, it's go time. Niggas don't want no trouble. Earl know what it is. Earl had no choice but to be our friend or he was going to die. Earl was this close to death. Earl had to be our friend. We had to take him in. His, he had to, he had to abandon his neighborhood. Niggas spent so much pressure on his neighborhood. He had to abandon that joint and get a new neighborhood. He had to come to hang. He had to form a alliance with us. Nigga, let him hang out. Nigga, let him kick it. Nigga, don't be on nothing. Yeah, nigga, Earl right there. Earl don't be on nothing. Earl ain't no shit. Earl know these true facts, man. Earl know he rode that bike past the guys, Uncle Buckets. Earl know what the fuck is up. Earl is bluffing. Tell Earl talk that gangster shit now. Right there by the stadium under that tree is not safe. I'm telling you, nigga, first class flight his ass. But ain't nobody on that. I don't want nothing to happen to Earl. I ain't beefing with him. He know he did some sucker shit behind that chain. Ask Earl. Swag was there and people was in the hotel room. When Earl came back without that chain, ask Earl what I asked him. I said, Earl, I will smack the shit out your bitch ass right now. Earl was about to cry. Earl would have said anything. I'd have put that dog on his ass. Earl got robbed for not having a pistol. I never moved like Earl. When Earl told me he ain't had no pistol, ask him, did I have one? Fuck you talking about? I would, we should have said, yeah, Earl, let's go get the chain back make him drive. We already knew Earl was fishy from the beginning. I really say Earl life and swag got a heart. Because if swag ain't have a heart and it wasn't be about to be my birthday and I just bought a wash and was in flow, if I was one of them broke-ass crummy niggas, on Bob a couch and that was my last chain and my last little bit of money. We'd have said, yeah, Earl, let's go get that joint. Let's go find him. You would have drove. We'd have turned the music up. We'd have killed your dumb ass. You could have died that night, Earl. Only reason you ain't died because I got a heart, you fucking clown. Hit the subscribe button. I'm trying to get to 100k subscribers. Inside, man, might be the greatest that ever did it.